the cake. Well, the tuk-tuk is to Bangkok what the black cab is to London. It's part of the street furniture, if you like. But they're pretty loud, smelly, horrible things. Until now, a local Air Force Air Marshal has turned a tuk-tuk into a very green machine. As you can see on the top, this one is solar-powered uh, via a battery. It's got a range of about 60-odd uh, kilometres. Uh, it's pretty nippy. So, jump on board, let's take it for a quick spin. Well, here are the, uh, here are the controls. Uh, a rocker switch, forward, neutral and back. Uh, stop and start, pedal, steering wheel. Really couldn't be uh, any simpler. Now, the acceleration is pretty good. It's literally, you know, direct from the electric motor underneath the seat to the, uh, to the wheels. So, uh, off we go. I've been told the brakes, though, aren't brilliant. So, uh, we'll uh, just be a little bit... Uh, a little bit careful. Now it's 32 degrees outside, which is uh, gorgeous for open air motoring, although I just feel a bit like being in a sort of uh, Cold War era Soviet sun lounger. It's all very uh, yellow and plastic, and um, well, we've got some cover from the, from the sunshine. They've sold quite well in the UK, in Europe, uh, in New Zealand, places where it's not always 32 degrees and sunny. Now, it's uh, rather nice having the waft of Thai food and the waft of uh, nice warm air around your knees, but um, I can't imagine it's very pleasant doing it in the middle of winter uh, in Europe or down in the Southern Hemisphere. Now, the air marshal that's, that's done this has uh, been used to ordering armament for, for the Air Force, controlling squadrons of F-16 fighters, but this is his passion. And not only has he designed this electric tuk-tuk, but he's designed Thailand's first fuel cell car, powered by hydrogen, uh, has a range of about 90 kilometers, top speed of about 50 miles an hour, about uh, 80 kilometers an hour, and uh, that's pretty impressive. So, uh, I don't know, maybe the, uh, the next trip we should do is not round the world by Ford Fiesta, round the world by tuk-tuk. Quite sure though whether we do it on one charge. <laughs>